Yo, I ain't here for the money, I ain't here for the fame. Though it might be nice to own a jet plane, I'ma do it all for you. Come along and see us. Peter, I'm about to begin another test. Oh, sorry. My bus broke down and uh, there were no cabs. But I'll be there as soon as I can. Alrighty, and that's how we're gonna start this one, I guess. Let's go help Otto with the new experiment. Alrighty. Otto, I'm here. What do you have for us today? Hey, sorry I'm late. Morning, Parker. Or is it evening? That doesn't matter. It's, it's evening. Check the neurosensors, would you? We need a faster response time. On it. Uh, okay. Try to get it under three milliseconds. Three. What? What? Here we go. Trying to get another little puzzle. <sighs> okay, looks like I could optimize this power relay. Okay. Alright, so it has to go there. There we go. Nice. <coughs> okay, what next? Looks like some impedance in this neurosensor circuit. Oh my god. There we go. Finished. Okay, so one more. Signal to noise is out of whack. A new signal processor should reduce lag. <sighs> okay, so that's be a five and what Which ones do I have this? So if I change this to a two. There we go. There we go. And that's all it needed. Hey. I got it, Doc. 2.8 milliseconds. Good work, Peter. All right, Otto. Yep, yeah, be ready. Hey. Holy crap. I'd call that a mild success. I'd call that unbelievable. Oh no, it's stuck. Do you need some help? Yes. Oh no, 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 this is not good. Okay, I thought he, this is when he was going to turn to Doc Ock. Doctor, what's going on? It's become that obvious. My doctors call it a degenerative neurological disorder. Probably caused by overexposure to toxic chemicals in my reckless youth. Sorry, is, is, is there anything I can do? You already are. The worst part is, it only affects the muscles. The mind continues to work, but can no longer do. Aww. You're the only one who knows, Peter. I'd like to keep it that way. Of course. Yeah, you got it, uh, Doc. If you 
I'd like to seek a position with more of a future. I, I came here to work for you because of what you've got up here. And that's not going anywhere. So neither am I. Hey. That's a good friend right there. Oh, Peter, before I yeah. forget, yeah. I read the most fascinating article. Outlines possible next steps for the neural interface. I'll take a look. Thanks, Doc. Yeah, thank you, Doc. All right, let's go see what he's talking about real quick, then. Oh, it's inside. Man, I remember the first day I interviewed here. I showed up with stains on my shirt, ten minutes late from stopping a mugging. Oh, God. I still can't believe Doc hired me. Hope he doesn't regret it now. Nah, I he, he loves face with the basal ganglia. Exciting, but risky. I don't know, Doc. You'll need a gallium silk array to make it work. Even then, odds of injury are pretty high. Gallium! Genius! Never mind the risks. We'll work them out in time. Alrighty, then. Well, I guess that's it. Oh. Are you coming by today? Um, I mean... Doc, I'm sorry. My aunt just texted. No worries, Peter. I was thinking of taking a break myself. As soon as I check our telemetry data. Thanks. I'll be back in a few hours. Alrighty, I guess we're gonna have to see Aunt May right now. But alright, so Aunt May, what would you like today? Hi May. Let me guess. Running late? Nope, I'm actually on my way now. Have you heard from Miles? No, but his mother said he was coming, so Good. I'll be there soon. Bye. What are you doing here? Oh, God. Oh, we got a fighter. You just made your last mistake, Hong. No, you did. What the Seriously, take this many guys to rob a teenager? Right? Spider-Man. You're the amazing Spider-Man. You're the spectacular Spider-Man. And a few other choice adjectives Jameson uses. Look, <laughs> that was really brave. But next time, leave the fighting to the pros. Okay? Uh, okay, but what if there aren't any around? Well, you can't just go swinging at someone twice your size. I mean, don't get me wrong. I fight guys stronger than me all the time. But when I do it, I have... Oh, like that time you fought Rhino on the Brooklyn Bridge? Oh, that was God. so awesome. Perfect example. <laughs> The other guy's bigger, you gotta be quicker. Okay? Okay, but that's it's easy for you to say. I, sorry, I just can't do what you do. Alright, put him up. Wait, Seriously. what? Yeah, come on. Come on, Spidey. Don't. First thing, don't let the adrenaline get to you. Breathe slow, breathe deep, relax. Hip square to your opponent. Let them make the first move. Now use your feet. And when they go off balance, look for an opening. Boom. Like that? Yeah. Yeah, that's it. Okay. Not only this time, just let me have it. Right on the jock. Okay? I can. <clears throat> oh, sh. S sorry. No, no. No. <laughs> it's all good. <laughs> you keep that up and uh, you'll be fine. All right. Lesson's over. Gotta go. Hey. Uh. Thanks. You know. Anytime. Aww. I think that's what he really needed. It was like, it was that it's little push and pull. Oh, Miles again? This is awesome. Shelter should be just ahead. Yeah. Have a great day. Oh. Oh. Yo, Miles, what's up? Bro, you're not gonna believe this. I just met Spider Man. What? That's crazy. 
Hey, did you show him our hacking app? Oh, man. I totally forgot. Oh, you suck. He totally would have bought it off you, and then we'd be, like, famous. Yeah, I'll show him next time. I, I gotta go. I promised my mom I wouldn't be late. Uh, cool. Later. Farmer's market. I can cut through there. Over to the side. Over to the side. Come on. Keep moving. Keep moving. Yeah, yeah. Calm down. I mean, I like how they, they switch between the characters, like between Miles, MJ, and Spike. It's awesome. And for those of you that don't really know much about Miles, there's a movie coming out called Spider into uh, into the universe or universe, uh -oh. something like that. Yeah, yeah, but yeah, that's him. He's an Ultra Spider-Man in another universe. Jeez. It's gonna take forever. What do you know? wasn't watching. I could jump the fence. You know anyone by the name of Martin Lee? Oh! Wow, that was too easy. I can't believe Sable systems are unsecure. Maybe I'll send an anonymous tip. Okay, okay so I gotta I get around. Don't fail me now. Maybe I could turn on that siren. What siren? Okay, oh, we're gonna hack that again. What siren? Oh. Okay. Okay, time okay. to move. Right. Nope, you didn't see anything, boy. Back over there, please. <coughs> yep. Okay, let's see. I can go under the gate on the left or over the scaffolding to the right. <coughs> let's go over. <coughs> this part dangerous. Oh. oh more drones? Guns? Oh, can't let them spot me. Right. Okay, they see me once and it's over. Oh no! Can you like... There Maybe you go. Wait. This would be so cool. It was less terrifying. Mom. Hi, honey. Did you make it to the thief shelter okay? I'm almost there. Uh, yeah, almost there. Miles, you don't have to work at that shelter, you know. You said I did. No, I gave you a choice. Yeah, and I chose this over more therapy. I mean, it was helpful. The guy said everyone grieves in their own way. This is mine. Okay. Sorry. Mom. Yeah? Just because I don't want to talk about it doesn't mean I don't love you. I gotta go. I'll call you on my way home. Alright, here we are. Feast. I'm dead demon feast. You know what? Just, just keep breathing. I'll be back soon, Mr. Punch. Hey, hey, Miles. Pete. Hey, um, sorry I'm late, man. Oh, no, no. I'm just glad you're here. Alright, so, um, what can I do to help? Why don't you start just by, uh, Getting comfortable with the place. Uh, meet a few people. You know what? Everybody loves coffee. Coffee? All right. And I'll be back in a little while to check on you. Is that cool? Yeah. Oh, don't worry about Mr. Hodges. He doesn't bite. Much. You sure? Coffee? Thanks. Need help? 
Not unless you know what the hell a quark is. It's a subatomic particle. You know, the building block of protons, neutrons, hadrons? Subatomic? It fits. Good one, kid. Piece of junk. Oh, hell. Damn hunk of junk. Uh, you mind if I take a look? Eh? Oh, we have a couple of CRTs at school. I know how to fix these CR when they're... CR what, what? No, no, you just gotta smack it. Up the time. Get it. Go. Or, could be a loose coax cable. <sighs> all right, all right. Be my guest, huh, Mr. Smarty Pants? Hey, please, go ahead. Tributes continue to pour in for Officer Jefferson Davis, the hero killed in the City Hall bombing, as reports emerge that he used his own body to shield others in his last moments of life. Hey, hey new kid. I'm empty here. Hero. Man didn't do nothing heroic except get himself blown up. Come on, guys. Hey, like, that's mean. I see you've met Miles. He's gonna be helping out around here. You may have heard of his father, Jefferson Davis. Pretty great that even though he's got a lot of stuff going on right now, he decided to come and volunteer. Don't you think? Uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Thanks. Uh, listen, Cat, I'm, I'm... Sorry about your dad. Come on, Miles. Let's see if Ant-Man needs a hand in the kitchen. Hey, May. I gotta take off, but, uh... Brought some help for you. Hi, Miles. Nice to see you. Well, grab an apron, wash your hands, and I'll show you around. Yeah. Hey, hey Peter. Yeah, Miles. Thanks for that back there. Of course. Oh. Almost noon. Sable should be moving Dr. Michaels. Better get to the Bowery and locate him. I'm afraid our computers are a bit outdated. Well, that's cool. Might be able to improve their performance for you. Really? <laughs> All right, this is gonna be interesting. This next part, then. Well, that's good. We we helped yeah, Miles. Back. Oh yeah. Hey Yuri, I'm heading to the Bowery to make sure Michaels gets to his new safe house. You know, safely. I wouldn't do that. Silver Sable made it clear you are not welcome. Yeah, well, what's she gonna do? Shoot me? Honestly, fifty-fifty chance. Ah, fine. I'll be in the neighborhood, but not too close. Just in case. Okay, so that's gonna be interesting. Alright, but... Looks like we're going to do that now. Okay, be straight with me. If this devil's breath gets loose in the city, what's our worst case scenario? Oh, uh, you know, global pandemic, end of the world, that kind of thing. Why did I even ask? Of course, it's always something bad. This is the Bowery, but where's Dr. Michaels? Alright, let's find out. We're ready for you, Dr. Michaels. Is that the Devil's Breath? It's called GR-27, not... <sighs> Just be careful. In the wrong hands, this could... Don't worry, we're the best in the world. <sighs> I feel better already. Code 381, package is on the move. This way, Dr. Michaels. <sighs> Alrighty. What the hell is that? Oh. That's not good. That's what that is. Oh. Oh. These guys better shot some okay, never mind. And of course. Oh, well, hello, Lee. 
Welcome aboard, Doctor. I guess that's my cue to start chasing them. Get off me! We got this! Yeah, sure you do. Martin Lee. I think he's got Dr. Michaels and the Devil's Breath. Copy that. More units coming your way. He took Michaels alive, so that's good. Probably so we can force him to make more Devil's Breath. I have to stop that truck. Tank. Whatever. Just shoot everything. I need to clear the guys in the trucks before I go after Lee. Take him out. Oh no. We make this quick. I got a date with your boss. <laughs> yeah, pull yourself up, you idiot. Target locked. Oh my god. He's coming. He is coming, and Who's he will coming? destroy all sinners. Oh, it's one of those guys. <laughs> Yo, this is one of the best scenes I've seen in a while. Lee, hand it over. Oh no. <laughs> nope. Oh my god. Oh my god. What's your status? Have you apprehended Lee? Nope. Working on it. Working on it. Saved your life, didn't he? He was here because of you. Do wait, does he know? And Norman wanted to use him. A futile gesture in the end. And where was Norman during all this? Slinking away like a rat. He knew what was going to happen, and he fled. Norman is a hidden cancer on this city. He must be exiled with no trace of his corruption to return. Norman hides behind his mask of lies. I will break it apart and drag him into the light. Put on the mask. Become one of us. No. 
thanks, but no thanks! One way or the other, you will join me! Oh god. Uh -oh. All the souls you've lost! The innocent victims you couldn't save! Martin! Their blood is on your hands! You can stop Osborne! You have so much strength! I can give you will! Okay. Did they take it? Yes. How worried should I be? Very. Oh god. You're a popular guy. Where's the serum? Gone. I'm gone. The Discoya. This, what? So called superhero. You can't <sighs> save people, but you just make it worse. I mean, this is your fault. You My just fault. got here. Who's under your protection? Yeah. You really need two of those? <laughs> Oof. Stop. Nice. We need to brief Mr. Osborne now. I'll go with her. Thank you. I'll remember this. Alrighty then. <laughs> Crack the jaw a little bit. Yuri, tell me you've got a lead on Martin Lee's location. We have footage from a guy at a coffee shop. Looks like he hopped into a black sedan after the crash. Are you black serious? sedan, great. Let me finish. We have a partial plate. And one of my patrol guys just found a matching plate. Black sedan in a parking lot near Canal and Hudson. You're a good cop, Yuri. I'm on my way. Alrighty, and that's what's next. Holy crap. Spider-Man. Oh, what's this? Hello? Yeah? Is this working? Dr. Michaels? How are you calling? Borrowed one of Sable's radios. Listen, transit hubs are the most likely release points for Devil's Breath. Airports, bus terminals, train stations. It'll spread like wildfire from there. 
Why the hell is Oscorp developing a bioweapon in the city? Shouldn't this be in an Arctic bunker? Devil's Breath is personal for Norman. It's been his obsession for decades. The project breaks every state and federal regulation on the books, but he doesn't care. If the city finds out, he can kiss re-election goodbye. Oh, yeah. Never mind re-election. He'd be tried in The Hague for war crimes. Why are you telling me all this? Yeah. Aren't you just as culpable as Norman? Yes. Completely. But Lee's actions have been a wake-up call. We've ignored the project's risk for too long. I trust you, Spider-Man. You're the only one trying to do the right thing. Please, protect the city from our mistakes. Alrighty, you got it. Man, that was insane. Alright, well, let's go and save the city again. Feels great, motherfucker, yeah! <laughs>